Hi, my love, beautiful souls. It's Mystic Rules 1111. I'm back with you, bringing dark into light. This time must read, so please take what resonates and leave what does not fit for somebody else. Collective reading, not for stream. Thank you to everyone liking, sharing, subscribing to my channel. Thank you, thank you so much, guys. I love you and not be where I'm at. It's not for you guys, but the most high, so thank you so much. If you're new, hit the like button, share, subscribe, hit the bell button, no, bell button you can know if I'm. Thank you for the donations, super nice, and booking rooms with me and purchasing products. Thank you, thank you so much. I appreciate the generous donation that I received today. I, I appreciate it. Thank you so much. I would email you, but I don't have your email address. Um, I did receive it through PayPal. So if you are watching this, you know that um, if I received a PayPal donation. Thank you. Thank you so much for that. I appreciate it. I, Like I said, I wish I had your email so I could email you. Uh, so thank you. So you guys, I'm hearing uh, there is a karmic mother that's been interfering in your life. Okay, there's a karmic mother that's really, really in a low frequency, low vibration. Very hateful. Hateful towards you, hateful towards life, doesn't like life, okay? Is just out to get you and anybody that she doesn't seem good to her or like deem up to her standards, okay? I'm here up to her standards. This karmic mother has been been hateful since she was a child, okay? She was not loved. She didn't have she had a lot of stuff that happened to her and she could not heal. She could not, you know, forgive, okay? This mother also, and this is this is somebody's mom, okay? This is somebody's mom. So this could, you could be a man, you could be a woman, and this is a mom that you dealt with, okay? If if you're in a relationship, this mother was interfering in your relationships. If you had a job, this mother was interfering in your jobs. I'm hearing the mother could have showed up at her job, you know, just just showing up out of the blue, you know, causing conflict or even just not supposed to be there because it's a distraction, okay? It came at school too. I'm hearing showing up school. I'm also hearing this karmic mother could have showed up like high or drunk at social events, at school events, at your work or, you know, family gatherings and stuff like that. She wasn't, she wasn't in her right mind half the time. Uh, she, she wasn't loved. She didn't have good relationships. Okay. She could have went from relationship to relationship or just didn't have any relationship because of the way she was. Okay. She could have lost her parents. She could have had her parents. Her parents could have been like that to her. But she, this, this is just somebody that was stuck in with like in low frequency. I'm also hearing possessed by the devil, Satan. Okay. I am hearing she could have believed it. She could have said she believed in God, that she was Christian. She was, I'm, I'm hearing Lutheran. Okay. I'm hearing Lutheran or Catholic. Uh, she believed in God, but then she never really, you know, followed through with it. She may have had a Bible. She may have had this and like talked about it, but she wasn't like really, she was false about it. Okay. She was fake about it. Okay. She perceived her people perceived her as somebody different okay she was wearing a mask masquerade hiding who she truly was this person was dead inside okay this mother was dead inside she 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 may have had a soul but her soul was like dark evil cold you know so felt like soulless okay felt soulless okay she was born um to you know fix her mistakes fix her life you know what i mean like she was supposed to She's supposed to do right this this life, okay? I'm hearing she's supposed to be doing right this life, and she's not. She's repeating the cycles over and over from past lives because she could have been karmic in a past life too. She And so she was reborn, reincarnated to, you know, not have to keep repeating the cycles, to learn from her lessons, and she's not. She continues to do the same thing over and over, okay? This, this some people may say she's a witch. She may, I don't, I, I'm not hearing she does, she practice dark magic or like witchcraft or anything like that but she's a very very dark mind okay very very negative mind wishing ill on people wishing that everybody's life would fall apart and that because she her life is falling apart so uh, i'm not hearing like she's one that's conjuring up spirits like you know doing black magic having books and stuff like that it's just she has a very negative mindset okay she she may not know a lot about like magic like not she may not even be conscious aware that magic is real and with her wishing ill, negative intent on other people, negative thinking, she's not realizing that she's doing more harm than good. This karmic mother, she's doing a lot more harm than good. Okay. So you've been dealing with this a lot. There's something that you're, you, you may have tried to fix this mother. You may have tried to help this mother. You may have, you know, you can try to get this mother, you know, help, therapy, counseling. She could still have addiction or alcohol problem. Or she's just a, just a mean old, mean old mom. I mean, oh, mom, it could be a grandma, too. Greedy. I'm hearing very, very greedy. It's about money. All she thinks about money. Okay? All she thinks about is money. Maybe you need all this money from you, begging you for money, needing your assistance, needing your help. She could maybe have, need to move in with you. She had nowhere to go. She can't. This mother may not be able to keep a job. She could have mental health issues as well. A lot of mental health issues. 
okay, not on medications. She may be diagnosed with mental health issues and she's not taking her medications. Okay, I'm hearing a mother could be bipolar and she's not taking her medications. Explosive disorder could get lashed out, could be very physical, abusive as well. Abusive, emotional abuse, abusive, spiritual abusive. I'm not hearing anything about sexual abusive though. I'm not hearing like, you know, molestation or anything like that. This is, she's just more emotional abusive and could be physical abusive too. Hitting you, smacking you. I'm hearing locking you in a room when you're younger or leaving you home alone or leaving you outside where you couldn't get in the house when it was cold. Okay, she'll be out all night, so I'm out all night, worried about her boyfriends, worried about um, money, greed. But she didn't have a job. I'm, I'm hearing something about not having a job, couldn't keep job, but she'll get off money off other people. She could have been a gold digger. So I'm getting like a black widow mother as well. Okay. Let's see here. Let's see what else do you want the collectors to know about this. Holy Spirit Angels in the High Heaven and Most High. Please give me a pregnant agreement with the collective. Which they need to know about, know about the situation. You're trying to balance in yourself out, okay? Try to balance your life out. I'm here and juggling back and forth. You could be juggling back and forth. Like, you want to love this mother. You want to forgive this mother. But this mother, like I said, okay? Because the devil is possessed by this with the devil, okay? addiction obsessive mental health okay so you could be going back and forth on what to do with this mother or like if you should cut this mother out if you should keep forgiving this mother this mother was queen of pentacles inverted okay unresponsible ungrounded shallow sociopath jealousy you didn't get to have a childhood she took that from you Childhood issues, sexual abuse, bad news. I'm not here. She could have been sexually abused. You could have been, but not by her. Okay? Somebody could have been sexually abused by a boyfriend of hers. Broken dreams, but... Yeah, a lot of child issues. She could never keep a job. They could never keep a job. Went from job to job to job. Getting fired. Showing up at work. So she, you could have been getting fired from work. She could have showed up for work. Like, a job. Getting fired. Drinking. This mother could have had like DUIs, DWIs, not have a license. You never knew where she was. You never knew where she was going. Yeah, she's on balance. Self-indulgence. It was always what, what betters her. Reckless. Lashing out. Arrogant. I suggest reckless, arrogant, show off, overindulgence. The tension on her as well. Yeah, this is a karmic mother. Insecurity, lack of growth, overbearing tendencies, negligence, ne 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 neglect, okay? She neglected you. But you have, you have an apathy for this person. You, you, you... You feel for this person, okay? You feel for this. You feel like this because this is your mom. You still love this mom, okay? See, this mother focused on the negativity. Self-absorption, depression. She has apathy. She was focused on the negativity, okay? Living in fear. Never sees the positive in things. What else, Spirit? What else? Thank you. Lack of independence. Needed somebody always to take care of her. Reckless spending. Trapped. Can't get out. There's a fear again. She played victim as well. She tries to play victim. Makes you feel bad for her, okay? This this mother makes you feel bad. That's why she's interfering in your life. This perfect mother could have stole from you, stole your inheritance, stole some kind of money, fortune from you. She even could have stole a relationship. You could have been in a relationship, she could have stole your boyfriend or a relationship from you. Okay? If there's a mother that stole a relationship from you, a boyfriend or girlfriend from you, then that relationship was not meant for you. Because no man or woman would go to a, a, a lover's parent. Okay? No man or woman would go to a parent, a lover's parent. Okay? So that relationship wasn't meant for you then. If you're in a relationship and you're in that person that cheated on you with your, your mom... 
that they're not meant for you. Okay, they're not meant for you. You're moving to calmer waters. You're getting away from the situation. Healing. Okay, you're healing from this. Because the overbearing, powerful mom, like control freak. Okay, this mom was controlling, kind of control your relationships. Trying to hold on to people, possess people, manipulate people. She came around because she needed financial stability from you. But you're getting this new beginning. God's giving you this new beginning. She keeps having bad luck, karma. Bad news is coming for her. Okay, this this karmic mother could be getting sick and could be going to jail as well. There could be a karmic mother going to jail. Okay, or ending up sick. Because she interfered in your life. She stole from you. She took from you. She's hateful for your come up. She prays on the weak. She prays, okay? She's, okay, yeah, I'm hearing praise. She's on the prowl. The devil. She's not sober. Okay, you could want this mother to get sober too. That could be why you're going back and forth. Like, you just want this mother to get sober, clean. Get the help she needs. Get the therapy she needs. She could be a psychopath. She could be being watched by the undercover cops as well, this karmic mother. This narcissist, this narcissist karmic mother. She's a narcissist, okay? This mother's narcissist. You are born to help bring light into her life, help help change her, help her help her become better. She don't like you, so they don't like you, but she didn't like you. Okay? Your energy, your essence, your your frequency vibration is too high for her. Because she has a demon attached to her. Demons don't like angels. Demons don't like earth angels. Higher vibrating people. Human beings. Karma's a bitch. Time's up for this mother. As I said, this mother's going to jail. Okay, if not, she's there could be something about death, okay? She no longer can do what she's been doing. Could have a bounty on her. This could be a spiritual bounty. This could be a physical bounty. Off with the head. She stole your money. She, or she didn't sell your money. She sold some of this money. She could have been stealing from men. Okay, that's why karma's coming back at him. Back at her. She could have been stealing from people. From the men. She could have ended up homeless. Only comes around when she needs something. When she like when I'm hearing a man a masculine could be kicking her out. Like she, they could kick her out. And then like she tries to come back into your life. She could be going through a jury trial. Okay, she could be involved with an ex friend. Okay, maybe she slept with an ex-friend as well. Or maybe you're just going to your ex-friend. Or she went to your ex-friend. She stole money from your ex-friend. I'm hearing she could have had help from your ex-friend, okay? One more. I said she could show up at work. Or she could have went to her work and kept getting fired. Losing her job. She wants position back. This mother wants to come back into your life. Okay, you may have cut her off. And she wants you to come back in her light like she wants you back in. She needs something from you. That's the only reason why. Or this ex-friend wants her position back as well. This ex-friend may want the position back. This mother may get in fights with her boyfriend, girlfriend. Okay, because she could be bisexual too. There could have been a mother that was a prostitute I'm hearing as well. It wasn't worth it. Not worth it. Your father could not put up with her shit. Okay? Her, your father could not have put up with her shit. Someone was naive. Your father could have been naive about her as well. Could there be a cousin involved? She could have stole from a cousin. Or live with a cousin now. Your cousin may not like you either. You escaped it. Okay, you escaped it. 
This mother always has to be right. Deception. You could have been a teenager when you escaped. You could have got away from this when you were a teenager. Apparently she embarrassed you at school. Okay, some people embarrassing you at school. Came to school drunk. She was having sex with random men. Your grandpa could have got you away from this. Okay, your grandpa could have got you away from this. Or she could have been she could have been sexually assaulted by her, her grandpa. We have Mars energy coming out. That's Aries and Scorpio. Mars is God of War. Okay. God of War, which is um chaos, destruction. Aries. Set in Egyptian. Set was uh, chaos. There's another god, evil god. Um, I can't think of his name. Okay, well, spirit. Okay, something about grandpa and grandma. Okay. Maybe you had an evil grandpa and grandma too, but or a good one that helped you out, got you away. Because his mother was spoiled. The grandpa grandma, so your grandpa and grandma spoiled this mother. She got away with a lot of things. I just keep hearing she thought she could just trick people the way she th thought she could, like get away with it. She was a bully. This mother was a bully. This this narcissist mother was a bully. She's having trouble sleeping at night now. If she abused you, physically abused you, she may have broke a bone. You may have gotten like a broken bone from her. Okay. Ended up in the hospital. If you've been bruised, beaten with a belt, a paddle, a stick. She'd never let you be happy. When she's saying you're happy, that's when she would come in and like stir up your life, like stir drama in your life, stir the pot, okay? Kane, pay attention to your health. Okay, this mother has to pay attention to her health. She's getting sick. Fox, shrewdness and resourcefulness, especially in business, okay? Yeah, she may have tried to do something in a business, okay? She could try to take some money out of your business, getting help. Fox is a tricky, uh, sneaky, sneaky animal as well. Trickster. Boat, money or property through inheritance, winning or windfall. So she could have stole this from you or taken it from you. Grandpa and grandma could have left it for you and she took it from you. Hid it from you, used it, spent it all. It's supposed to be left for you. You're supposed to be wealthy. This could come from a wealth of family. Wealthy family. This could be spiritual wealth too, okay? This could be spiritual wealth. Spirit wants me to let you know. What else, Spirit? What else? She's mad because you keep climbing the ladder to success. Keep climbing the ladder higher and higher. See, Skull, hidden, uh, hidden secrets can harm you. She was hiding a lot of secrets from you. Hiding a lot of stuff. Wheel. Indecisiveness, allowing your life to ramble aimlessly. This this mother, her life was just rambling around and around, scrambling around like she could never just stop. Like it was always go, 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 go around in a wheel. Okay, rose, romance in the air. Bread, period of prosperity and abundance. You're going to have some prosperity and abundance coming in. You could have lived in poverty at a young age. Grew up in poverty, grew up in the hood, grew, grew up in the ghetto or lower class. Fireworks. Okay, it says firecracker excitement. I'm hearing like, this is like, boom, fireworks coming off. Like something's about to explode. This mother's not going to be happy. Her going to jail or finding out that she's dying. This mother could be finding out she's dying because she's a narcissist bitch. Dealing with a woman. Fair, fair woman. Dealing with a relationship with a woman with blonde hair, gray hair, white hair. December.
she's Luciferian. So she could, like I said, she believed that she was a like God. Or she said she believed in God and stuff. But she was actually worshiping Lucifer. Ages between 40 and 50. Or 30 and 40 and 50, 60. So ages between 30 to 60. She's trying to block their blessings. This mother has been trying to block their blessings. She don't want you to have these blessings. She don't want you to be happy. She's an inferior lifestyle. Untrustworthy. Knockoff. Cheap. Sold out. She'll sell you out. She, okay, I'm sure she's selling you out to the highest bidder. Okay, she could try to sell you. She could try to, like, give you up. And not the legal way. What else, Barrett? I'm hearing this is something that's even for everybody. I'm hearing she only got pregnant because she wanted to have child support or she wanted to receive some kind of wealth, okay? By having a child with this man. She wanted some kind of wealth. Thinking it's going to be handed to her. That's not for everybody. Okay? Fake apologies. Trying to come back. Asking for your forgiveness. Okay, but you're not sorry about it, okay? Like, they're not sorry. Wanting second chances. It's all fake. I'm hearing you just wanted to be loved by this mom. You just want to be loved. You just want your mom to show you respect, to treat you with dignity, with dignity, to treat you kindly, loving. CPS could have been involved. Child Protective Service, you could have got put in foster care. Okay, got adopted out. Reports, welfare, investigation. She could be finding out she has cancer or a cancer sign. One more, please. Yep, see? Birth, right, legacy, destiny, inheritance, old money. There is a mother that wanted to, she got pregnant by, a, by your father. Okay, by your father because she wanted to come in some kind of wealth. And that's the only reason why she got pregnant. But she never really loved you. It's kind of like the movie Flowers in the Attic. There's a lot of incest there too. Um, but Flowers in the Attic. Girl wanted to get pregnant. She wanted to be with like the wealth, money. Always greedy. Needing more. More and more and more. That's what she wanted. More and more. This mother embarrassed you a lot too, okay? This mother embarrassed you a lot. She could have threatened you as well. Okay, some kind of threatening threatening you. She had made you do stuff that you didn't want to do at the time. So she made she forced you to do some things that you didn't want to do. I took 24. You could be 24 years old. I, will, I, want you to say, I want to say this too. God wants you to know that you're loved. Okay, you are loved no matter what. Even if your mother did not love you the way you want to be loved, you are loved. You are loved by God. Okay, there's going to be somebody else that loves you. Okay, God wants you to love yourself as well. Even though you went through all this trauma, this pain, you are loved. Okay. Anderson, Grandma Francis, I'm not your problem anymore. This mother may not be your problem anymore. You may have walked away. You may have cut this mother off. Impala, Morgan, Prendes, Yellow School Bus. Someone could be a driver. Uh, someone could drive this Yellow School Bus, okay, or like, you know, School Bus. Like, some are white. I mean, this one, they're yellow, um, but I have seen some where they've been white. Uh, but somebody could have been a bus driver or something happened on School Bus. Dragons, Manor Park. Stephenville, Texas, Lucian, Lucian, Desiree, Cherry, someone likes cherry pies, someone likes cherry pies, or somebody likes cherries, Tito, I found the, I found the love I need to want, so you may have found somebody that you love and need it, like that you want and you love, and this mother could be inf interfering, okay, this nurse's mother's trying to interfere, she's going to go to jail, she's not going to be able to break you up, like I said, she's not going to be able to break this up, okay, Bitch, you mad? This mother's just mad. Little Rock, Salt Lake, Young, 
777 abundance, energetic alignment, teacher, God, number, perfect vibration, leader, good luck, blessings, miracles, happiness. Sanchez, Carmi, Slovakia, Zebra. Zebra, you're freed now, okay? Freedom. Wild spirit loving inside, living inside you. You have a loving, you have a wild spirit living inside of you. Zebra energy. And when I look at Zebra too, I look at black and white, the divine feminine, divine masculine, the yin and yang, balancing that out, okay? Bringing it together. CSI, crime scene investigator, somebody's assigned CSI, crime scene investigator, or some kind of investigation took place. Showstopper. Okay, so this mother, okay, this is fuck me hard, um, then fuck me again. Someone likes to be fucked and then they come. Okay, this is a sexual card. I should be taking this one out. Let me take this one out after, okay? Um, this mother lady likes to fuck a lot. Antonio. Okay, I'm going to take that card out because I, I, I want to put that in a sexual deck, not this one. Okay. Elkhart. Elkhart. Hicks. Blacklist. Chicago. Eric. Andreas. Tacoma. Mail Clinic. Somebody can be finding out they are getting cancer treatment at Mail Clinic because they're sick. They can't steal your shine. So this mother cannot steal your shine, okay? She can't take it from you. D. They hire a detective to look into your life. This mother could hire a detective to look into your life. You could hire a detective. Somebody look, hire a detective to look into your life. Matt. Improve. Your life is improving, okay? Since you cut this mother out or since this mother went to jail. Movie Industries. Hid, hid from you. Mask on. Somebody's hiding. Okay, mask on. Byron. Celestial. Tongue piercing. Somebody has tongue piercing. Someone slept with your brother or sister. Uh, Mon Montreal. Someone slept with your brother or sister. Okay, been your ex-friend. You could have felt like an orphan, I'm hearing, okay? You could have felt like an orphan. Your mom, like, left you, and you felt like an orphan. You felt like you had nobody. She's a false person. False people have seen her as somebody different. Immature. Immature, childish. In despair now. Freaking out. This mother's freaking out. She may be serving time. This mother may be serving time, or she could already be in jail. Judicate, wild adjudication. You're going to have some kind of unexpected income. And something's not changing for her. This was a really, really rough house, okay? This house was upside down. Like, there's too much stuff going on. Secrets hidden, you know, physical stuff. Like, things that were hidden. Like, people did not see what was going on in this house. Okay? A lot of things when you were a child. By a wealthy man. This mother could have hooked up with wealthy men. Okay, went for mon men for money. She's never gonna. I'm hearing this mother's never gonna change. That's why it's not coming out. That's coming out too. This mother's never gonna change. When I look at this house card inverted too, that's why I was talking about Flowers of the Attic, the movie Flowers of the Attic. People didn't know how bad you had it when you were a kid, okay, in your house, okay? People didn't know how bad it was in your household. How bad this mother treated you. How bad this mother treated other people. This mother picked a lot of fights, like to fight, okay? She could have been in jail for fights, too, because that could be why she's going to jail. Okay, this narcissist mother... She's been trying to ruin your life since day one. Since you're born. I'm here and leaving you alone in the bathtub, not paying attention to you, wanting you to drown. Okay? Not feeding you. Could have been poisoning you to make you sick to end up in the hospital. You could end up being sick in the hospital because of this mother. She's cursed. This, this karmic mother's cursed. 
She's sick. She's ending up sick now. She has an uh, illness that's not going to be uh, curable. Chill of the night. A lot of things happen. Children, she could try to sacrifice you as well. This could have been a foster mom. Because when I see children, I have seen several children here. Okay, it wasn't just to you. Lies. Lies, okay? This mother needs to confess. She may be going to the other side. Okay? She may end up going to the other side. The reaper might come for her. Angel of death may come for her. And she was trickster. She was a clown. Crazy clown. You just want to live in peace. You keep your heart open, though, too. You do. You wish and pray that this mother can get better. You wish and pray this mother can change. Okay, that's what I'm hearing. You keep praying to the most high to help this mother change. Help this mother. First quarter moon in Lewo, be humble. Be humble for what you have. This made you. This narcissist mother made you become a better woman or man. Okay, become a better human being. You didn't want to turn out like them. You wanted to be the opposite of them. Okay, I just said that you want to be the opposite of them. How they treated you, you did not want to treat other people that way. If you have kids, if you don't have kids, if you're going to have kids, you just don't want to treat other people. You want to treat people how you want to be treated. So with this mother treating you this way, you do not treat people disrespectful. You're a very kind, loving, caring person. You're the total opposite of this narcissist mother. First quarter moon in cancer. Push through your any insecurity. This mother caused you to have a lot of insecurity. A lot of doubts about yourself, self-confident, or not allowing you to be confident in yourself, like making you worry. Okay, not feeling, making you feel like you're not worthy enough, okay, but you are. Okay, you are. God's helping you through this 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 time in your life, okay, this journey, this, this situation, helping you through your trauma. Helping you heal. You don't want to keep your, you don't want to repeat repeat this cycles is what your mom did you don't want to repeat this you know toxic behaviors you don't want to be cursed you're breaking these generation curses 18 new opportunities keep positive thoughts okay keep positive thoughts this mother is very negative and you're a very positive person it is okay to still believe and think positive about your mom changing okay becoming a better person aquarius scorpio virgo scorpio and number four i love you love you peace light and namaste